Hey guys, this is iChronics from AppleIt.org. Okay, so I'm here today to show you um, another video of the AppleIt No Jailbreak app. Okay, so we've made a couple of improvements, just sort of streamlined the process a little bit, taking away a couple of tedious little steps. Um, I just wanted to clarify a few things, we've had a few questions from users and sure on bits and bats. Okay, so as mentioned in prior videos, you need a developer certificate for this to work guys. Okay, so for that you're going to want to head over to http regmyudid.com um, get yourself an advanced developers package. Okay, so once you've got that, you're going to get sent an email um, which will contain a link. Um, alternatively, you can go to the App Addict website, like so. Uh, you're going to click on the Sign Service tab near the top. And on that page near the top, there is a link that says click on this link on your iDevice to start using Sign Service. Okay, so if you've already bought the service, click on there and this will ask you to install the App Addict profile. Install now. And your passcode if you have one. Okay, it's going to take us to a little page, a little status page. Okay, very quick. It's going to then ask you to install the app. So there you go, it's very quick getting the app on there. So the first time you open up, it's going to take just a little bit to load up. And it's going to straight away ask you to install the AA app authorization. So this is the last profile that you will need to install. Okay, so straight back into the app. So again guys, this is just the normal app addict version, so you've got everything that the jailbreak version has got, um, it, it's all on here. Okay, so I'm going to choose, let's go for Transport General. Okay, so it's quite a small app, so I'm going to click the link, so I'll go for the file there. Okay, so it brings you up a status page, okay, which says... Basically, signing it straight away, it's, a, it's only a very small app. So with these kind of apps, it's worth keeping this status page open because what it's going to do is, it's going to, as soon as it's signed the app, it's going to auto-generate you a link. There you go. Okay, so that you've straight installed the app without necessarily leaving the app edit app. Okay, that works for your smaller apps. Um, for your slightly larger apps, I'm going to show you a different way around um, so you don't have to sit looking at the status screen also guys I just want to quickly mention this does remove iTunes metadata we've had a few people asking so I, I'm confirming it does remove iTunes metadata there you go that's transport general installed and working okay so quickly I'll just show you what I would personally do with your slightly larger apps. You can do this with any app if you like. Um, okay, so Titan HD, it's yeah, 152 meg. So it may take a minute or so to resign. Okay, so I'm going to use File Bay again. So it brings me to that status page. Now instead of leaving that there, um, I'm just going to hit Done. Okay, it's still signing in the background. I can still use the App Edit app. I can continue to resign further apps. Okay, what it's going to do once it has resigned, it's going to send you out an email. Okay, so I'll just refresh, waiting for that to come in. I mean, this wasn't the biggest, so it should, there you go. Okay, sign of Titan HD has been done. So I'll click the install link, it then takes me to that install off the status page. Okay, so that's just another way around of doing it because some of your bigger apps may take a little bit of time to sign. Okay, I'm not going to let you watch this install all the way. So I hope you like the video guys, just uh, rate, comment and subscribe as always, um, like always we will be improving the app um, in the coming weeks, um, thanks for watching guys.